हेलो मैम कैन यू इंट्रोड्यूस योर सेल्फ येस माई नेम इज अंजू चौधरी आई एम एन आर्टिस्ट आई एम रनिंग माई ओन आर्ट स्कूल सिंस लास्ट ट्वेंटी थ्री ईयर्स द नेम ऑफ द स्कूल इज शुभांगी आर्ट स्कूल हाउ डिड यू गेट स्टार्टेड एज एन आर्टिस्ट I started since childhood. Uh, I was very much fascinated towards making flowers, animals, and uh, I move ahead. Um, ma'am, what is your artistic style or your medium of choice? I love abstract art, and uh, my medium of choice is oil colors. Uh, but now I have seen that uh, acrylic is. more convenient because it dries faster than the oil so sometimes i use acrylic and uh, uh, for if i have a extra time then i go for oil colors um how do you promote your art or make a living as an artist in my opinion art is very important uh for uh, everyone not in the form of painting but dance drama music the all form of art are very uh, very essential in everybody's life it brings happiness uh and definitely this is a very good medium to um, get your uh, livelihood also uh, you don't need to work under any guidance it's your own uh, home own passion you can do whatever you want and you can handle your things on your own so you are boss and you are a worker also in the same way what motivated you to become an art teacher because of my passion i love what i do and if you don't have any passion you just going for money then you won't able to achieve anything first you should have a passion regarding your uh, work and then you definitely achieve definitely achieve it will take time everything cannot be done in a day or two um uh, ma'am can you give some tips for aspiring artists who are looking to improve their skills definitely hard work is the only answer and uh, internet books medium social media these are the best options you can use to improve yourself and go ahead what age group do you usually teach i am teaching 3 and 1/2 years to uh, as old as possible till now uh, i have a student of 3 uh, years to 85 years so the whole you can say uh, children to old persons the whole uh, that circle i am teaching male female all students all are coming to me and i'm all uh, guiding to everyone and ma'am are they all already skilled or know something about art or are yes, they beginners sometimes sometimes they know sometimes they are very hesitant that i haven't done anything can i learn so it's very good if you have learned and if you haven't learned then it's also fine because the new slate uh, if i have a new slate then i can draw much better than the already drawn one what do you enjoy most about teaching art i love each and every age uh, while teaching because i'm learning uh, from them kids they are innocent uh, so i can handle them much professionally or uh, emotionally much better because i'm grown up person uh, and uh, the, all those who are coming to me i'm learning from them if the youngsters are coming i am learning that uh, um how young people are thinking about the life and the surroundings and some way i am guiding them also that uh, in my opinion these are the right thing and as a, they are uh, not correct in this way uh, and the older one i am learning from them also because uh, they have uh, so many other things to accept uh, art to learn uh, how they are dealing uh, their day to day life uh, how they dealing uh, their uh, kids how they are learn, uh, learning from their professionals uh, so i am very happy that uh, i have so many students and they are guiding me uh, in uh, my all sphere of life i am very glad i am very glad and thanks to god 
Ma'am, I've seen that uh, you've recently published your work in a book. Can you show it and explain about it? Yes, definitely. You all, are, we all are aware that there is a corona, and at that time everyone was inside and uh, very much upset. So uh, I am also working in paintings, and the rest of the people are also writing or doing something. So I got one uh, suggestion that uh, I should work for this and uh, I have made a painting and uh, it was published in this book. Um, it's available on Amazon. It's published from uh, UK and uh, in this book there are lots of uh, not only painting the poem, poetry and other things were there and my painting also published in this. This is my painting. You can see it's a pandemic of perspective. Eh? This is um, which is published here. So I'm very happy, very glad to see this work. At Corona time also utilized. Have you exhibited your work in galleries or art shows? Yes, definitely. I started uh, exhibiting my things. Uh, uh, paintings as well as craft also since 2012 uh, since then I have exhibited five exhibitions uh, they are quite uh, big exhibitions um, earlier I used to display my paintings and my craft items alone but my students uh, insisted that they also uh, want to participate so now I have started working with them also uh, my sixth upcoming art exhibition is in December, uh, December 1st, 2nd and 3rd. Hopefully. How do you encourage creativity and self-expression in your students? Definitely, that is very important. Uh, whenever I am meeting to my um, kids' parent, I guide them, please do not restrict your child. Do not restrict. This is a place to self-expression. So whatever they are expressing is correct. In the painting, this is a basic thing that whatever you will make, that is correct. If you are making apple, blue, pink, purple, then it is also correct. Because in modern art, you can do whatever you want. But then why we are uh, punishing a small child for making a wrong uh, color combination? That is art. If you are asking the child, what is the color of an apple? then definitely the child should know the name, uh, the color of the apple. But if you are uh, making a painting that the person can make of any color, in the same way, um, others also, we should not restrict, uh, if we want our child to become a creative person, we should not tell this and that, let him open, give him objects and let him play uh, with the colors, let him draw whatever he is doing. Uh, slowly, slowly he will, uh, learn and he will make his own style we are restricting means we are making clone of the things which is not correct for the creativity if you want a creative child uh, you have to leave the child open uh, ma'am can you explain the meaning behind this piece of work uh, this is a very uh, meaningful for me because one girl who is in a growing age, I'm not very uh, old nor a child, is a, in a growing age. So like when you see any 13, 14, 15 year old child, so they have lots of thoughts in their mind. Uh, something is happening in their body also and the same happening in their brain also. So they won't able to understand what is the right and what is wrong. So in that, at that uh, moment, uh, they try to explore the world so in this painting this girl is going out and this is a morning time you can see and she is stepping out from the home for and these are the obstacles which i have shown here and uh, she is in a very hurry you can see these legs in a very hurry and she is moving ahead i'm very uh, glad i have seen this painting uh, from uh, some book and then I try to make it in the same way. It's not my original work. But definitely I like the painting and I have done it. Thank you ma'am.